Hey guys, what's going on? It's Amy again with Bargain Mama. It has been several weeks. I'm not even going to make excuses. I was a little busy. I was a little sick. Um, and then I was a little lazy. And I've decided like if I'm going to keep doing my channel, I have to either stay like at a consistency or I just need to quit because I can't like I get frustrated when I go to watch people's videos and they do them consistent consistent and then bam they're not there again for a while I'm like hmm this sucks like so I've decided um, I'm going to give myself the rest of May this video will be uploaded today so the rest of May and June to stay at a consistency or I think I'm gonna quit I, I don't think I'll end up quitting though that's the thing so um, I don't think I'll end up quitting just because I like to do it so much but I have to give myself like an ultimatum so that I have a goal to set so yes <laughs> so that's what I'm gonna do I am going to put up a video soon of um, I guess kind of um, I don't know what I'm thinking like my illness process since I got sick two years ago um, and what I've been through, some stuff has really been not good lately, but I mean, we don't focus on the bad stuff, right? Um, next week, guys, so today is when, no, today's Thursday. You guys, next week is a super stressful week for me. It's like, I don't want to start crying because I have to go back to work in a minute, but like my youngest son, so I'm 42. I had my first child at um, 18, like 18 and 11 months it was right before I turned 19 but so more than half of my life I've been a mom and I know I'll still be a mom when they move out but it just I feel like my whole world is like what am I I don't want to say what am I good for anymore but it's hard um so I might do a little video on that anyways it means my youngest is going to be 18 on Monday and he graduates the same week that Saturday that is rough guys that is rough so I might do a video on that just because I would love to see other people's videos on how they handled it um and I'll tell you like my husband is just like I don't understand the issue and I'm like okay get out of here anyways two minutes I have a very very short Dollar Tree haul only because I took so much other stuff already into my house um but I have a couple things in here. I figured I'd get on, say hello, at least do this haul. I'm telling you guys, if I don't do it in my car, it does not get done. Like, I just need to start leaving it all in my car. I need to. But um, anyways, I was looking for something down there, but it's not there. Um, so let's get started. Like I said, not a whole lot of stuff. I just wanted to get on and say hello. I did take my fake nails off last night. So my nails are atrocious today. So let's not look. Um, but I am going to put more on again tonight. I do take them off for one day to give my nails a chance to breathe. I've only been doing them for like, I think like two months now maybe. But it makes me feel so much better because I do have a lot of anxiety. So I do pick up my fingers. I do chew my nails. And because I'm an occupational therapist and I work with my hands a lot, I get so embarrassed. Like when I go to reach for a patient and stuff, like it's embarrassing. So, and I notice like when I'm talking to a patient, like I'll sit there and pick. But when I don't have, when I have my fake nails on, I don't do that. So yeah, you didn't care. You did not care. Anyways, let's get started. Like I said, a couple of things, but I have amazing stuff at home that I cannot wait to show you guys. I just already took it out of my car and I have Timu hauls up the wazoo like that. I'm going to name my first video. Are you tired of Timu? Me neither because I love it. But anyways, okay. And you guys, I got jeans from there. Jeans. I could not believe how they looked. Okay. Anyways, let's get going on this one. Sorry. So I did get two kinds of soup that I was super excited about. I don't know if it's worth $1.25. I feel like yes, because even if you get like a can of Campbell's now in a can that you have to take out and do all this stuff to, it's at more than a dollar. So this was $1.25 and this one is sweet corn and roasted poblano sipping soup and it's Campbell's and it's well yes and it is 11.1 .1 ounces and it's 130 calories per container and this whole container is microwave safe. So you shake well, you pull up the back cap to remove and you put it aside lift tab and slowly peel towards you microwave uncovered on high for a minute until hot or until hot um let stand for one minute and then you just put the cap back on and you sip it i was like what like i think that's so awesome actually what's under here is it like oh it is it's like a pull-off one super excited and it is good until something of 18 august 18th of 2023 so i did pick up one of these and it says plant powered i'm super excited about trying it because of corn soup i'm like that's gonna be amazing this one right here roasted red pepper and tomato it is vegetarian no artificial colors non-gmo this one is 140 calories and it is 11 ounces same thing but um 
like sip and go. You guys, I am in love with grilled cheese. Ever since I, probably even before that, but since I was 18 and pregnant with my oldest son, me and cheese are best friends. We are like the best of friends. Like it drives my family crazy because they like it. But I mean, I, every time, like, what do you want nachos? What do you want grilled cheese? Yeah, you guys, I didn't show you guys. I have a grilled cheese toaster. You put the, the bread in there with the grilled cheese and you literally put it down and it makes your grilled cheese. I'll show you guys that later. I love it. Like it's a grilled cheese toaster. My kids think it's insane and a waste of money. It is not. So anyways, I got this. It's like I said, um, roasted red pepper and tomato sipping soups. Again, I'm in my car a lot for work. So yeah, let me see what else I have in my little bag. Oh, so I do not wear these. I told you guys, I tried them like twice now. It's ridiculous. Like my eyes just flap in the wind. I don't care what kind of glue I use. I don't care how many people give me suggestions. I'm not ever using them again. Like I'm just gonna stick with no eyebrows and no eyelashes. Like that's that's my new gig. Like I can't. But I saw these and I was like, oh, those are super cool. <laughs> that's the back of them. And they're by Ardell Professional. They're aqua lashes. It says no adhesive needed, dip and apply. So I was super excited and I was like, yay. And so I so showed my son's girlfriend who wears them She's like, oh, those are crap. They don't work. And I was like, okay, well, sorry. So anyways, she said they're not good, but I picked them up. They're at the Dollar Tree. If they work for you, great. But she's like, nope, mm -mm, they do not work. So super sucks, but whatever. And on that note, you guys, we're having a boy. My, if you've watched any of my other videos, my son and his girlfriend are pregnant. This will be my first grandchild due in November. And we are having a boy. I super wanted a girl. I have three boys. My husband has a boy. We have four boys. Like, I mean, we got a lot of boys going on, but it's like, as soon as I found out, I didn't care. Because let me tell you, if you guys have ever watched the Boston Celtics, Jason Tatum, my heart, my heart, his son Deuce is the most gorgeous little boy I've ever seen in my life. I was like, okay, I'll let you have a boy then. Like Deuce Tatum, if you guys have ever seen this little boy and oh, he's gorgeous. This little boy is just gorgeous. I'll marry um, Jason Tatum just so I can be Deuce's stepmom. Yeah, super cute. Anyways, <laughs> weird, I know. If you guys, when you haven't seen me in a month, you guys, I got lots to tell. Um, so I picked these up. I picked these up before and they are just the two pack of the scope, no water needed, and they're just mini toothbrushes. And um, so again, my son's girlfriend has braces. Um, she sometimes gets nauseated. I mean, she's pregnant. And so, um, if we're like out to eat or something and anywhere she goes, like work and stuff. So she has to take her toothbrush and her toothpaste and all that. But I picked these up before and I thought, oh, well, if she likes them, I'll just pick them up. Y'all, you cannot find these. I have gone to Walmart. They did have them on Amazon. Super expensive on Amazon, may I point out. They were super expensive. So, and even when I was at Amazon or Walmart one day, I asked someone and they were like, I don't know what you're talking about. We don't. And I'm like a toothbrush with the toothpaste already on it. And they're like, we don't have those. They don't, they do not. So anyways, 125 for two toothbrushes. I like these because if you're traveling, if you're going somewhere, you can just throw these in there because it will never fail that my husband and I both grab our toothbrushes and we don't have toothpaste. Both of the last times we have gone on vacation, we have had to buy toothpaste. It's crazy. So Anyways, I got these more for her though. It has the pick on the bottom and the toothbrush and the toothpaste in the top. I was really thinking of um, Lori, I think it's Sykes from, um, I can never remember. Um, I love her channel. And she's going on a lot of vacations this year and she's trying to plan, um, she's trying to plan how she can pack light. Like, I feel like these would be super cute because you can use these on the plane and everything. You don't have to worry about how big your toothpaste is. Anyways, yeah. Now I'm gonna be mad because I can't think of it. Um, anyways, so my young, my middle son in LA loves SpongeBob, loves Star Wars, all that stuff. Um, so I found this, it's a melty bead kit and it's SpongeBob. And I was like, that is so cute. I mean, we haven't done these in a long time and it has the melty bead pegboard, double side pattern card, melty beads and wax paper. And you got to choose from the patterns and then it shows you back here, like after you do it, what to do in the instructions. And I was like, that is super cute. And it's by Nickelodeon. Yeah, it's just the SpongeBob. So I got that for him. I did pick up one of these. I think there was a light pink. I did not pick up that one. They are just like little it's kind of see-through bags. Where the heck is the zipper on this one? Hello? Okay. Um, I like these a lot. 
just because of the color. See, and I told myself in the store, check the zipper, check the zipper, Amy, and I did not. Oh, it works. I just needed to be a little bit more forceful. Um, I mean, these, I feel like, I mean, these, these are pretty big. I mean, they are a good amount and they have a little hand thing. I'm going to take the sayings off the front super easy with acetone. Um, but I think these are super cute. I'm not sure what I'm going to do with them yet. I think I'm going to use them as like, um, put like a little pen in them and little notebooks and stuff and maybe try to, um, I don't know. I don't know. I just thought they were super cute. So I got them in the purple. I got them in this beautiful blue and in this like fluorescent pink. That's the one that caught my eye. There was a light pink, but I was like, you don't need them all. Um, so hold on. I got more. My youngest son just said he needed more lotion and I don't know what he does with the lotion. He must eat it or something. So I just got him this huge thing, Novell men's body lotion, 16.9 ounces. I've gotten it for him before. And then the exfoliating facial scrub, I've needed more. And I used to get a different kind that they had there and I have not seen it. This is very little global beauty care, 1.7 ounces. Um, so it's not really worth it, but I really needed it. So I got it and then I'll just pick up more later. Let me put these back in real quick. Hold on. I got more. This next one, guys, super cute. Super, super cute. I found this, and at first I thought that it was in the wrong section and that they had meant to put it in the dollar plus section, but there was a whole peg clip there, so it was not. This is Glam and Beauty Temporary Hair Chalk Pens. Add temporary streaks of color. Great for parties and sleepovers. Five colors, five washable hair chalk pens. I mean, I think that's awesome. I actually want to try these in my hair. I've always thought about doing different colors, but I would never do it even like a semi-permanent just because I wouldn't want it in for that long, but I'm going to try them. And so I just got them for 125 temporary hair chalk pens. I think they're super cute. So you got the pink or and I love the colors. Like they're bright, like neon, the pink, orange, green, blue, and purple. Love it. It says, Apply pens to dry hair, evenly spread out the color with a comb, and then washes out with water and shampoo. So we're gonna try that. Excited. Let me see here. I did just pick up another thing of the Chewy Caramels, 2.40 ounces. I did make those little kind of, I guess, donut things, and the guys, they were amazing. I just got a can of biscuits, and I took one of these, and I rolled, I put this in the middle and then rolled it into a ball, put it in cinnamon sugar, baked it in the oven, and my kids loved them. So that's all I had to do. I mean, so you can, it was super easy. So like I said, I just took a can, I bought a can of biscuits, I took the biscuits out, I put a caramel in the middle, closed it, and then rolled it into a ball, put it in some cinnamon and sugar, put it in the oven. Super amazing. So, this is not a good deal, but I love Tillamook, so I really, and I, I never had this um, flavor, so I wanted to try it. Um, it is Chop House Bites, chopped and formed tender cuts of pork, Hawaiian style teriyaki, Tillamook country smoker, five grams of protein and 60 calories. It's only 0.7 ounces, but I just want to try it and see if I like it. If I do, then I'll buy the bigger one. But I, that flavor sounded amazing. And it says made with real pineapple. So I'm super excited about trying that. And then, let me put these over here. I did just pick up these last two things. Um, this pen right here, I really need to start making more notes. I have a million and a half notebooks at home and pens but I have not gotten them and I like keep leaving them at home and I just I have to have a notebook with me all the time so I just picked this up it's a Sarsa fine liner pen I picked it up in the pink and I want to open it real quick because I was nervous that the pink wouldn't show up so let me just open it real quick and I bought this. It says make it today counts. Oh, guys, I have a million and a half notebooks, but I was like, I really need it. I really need a new one. And so I got this, but I don't know if you can really see, but I like that there's dots. Cause y'all, I will doodle all day long. Like I will just sit there and doodle in like, I'll have like my important notes right here and no kidding doodle next to it. Like I don't even care. So, but let me see, let me write, let's uh, see. I should have gotten one that was darker. So this is, my name on there but I probably won't use it for this it's just too light that's my fault I had a feeling but anyways guys that's it that's my haul super excited about a lot of the things that I got 
I did find, again, when you watch my next haul, um, I did find the storage cases that I, oh my gosh, I've been wanting forever. I had 10 in my car. I was like, Amy, that's excessive. So I did get it down to five, but, and I told myself, so if you use these, you can go back and get more. There's no more. There's no more. Anyways, guys, I hope that you have a great day. I promise, like I said, I gave myself till the end of June to start doing videos more consistently or I'm going to have to say goodbye. And I have no one else to talk to. So I have to keep going, guys. <laughs> so I hope that you guys have a great day and I'll talk to you later. Bye, guys.